हेलो एवरी वन हेयर इज अव वीडियो ऑफ ओपन कार्ड प्री ऑर्डर प्रो दिस मॉड्यूल इज हाईली बेनिफिशियल फॉर द ओपन कार्ड ओनर्स सो दैट दे कैन सेट और दे कैन अपलोड प्री ऑर्डर प्रोडक्ट टू देयर स्टोर बिफोर द लॉन्च ऑफ द प्रोडक्ट सो कस्टमर कैन ईजिली प्री ऑर्डर और प्री प्री बुक the product before it comes to the retail sale admin can set pre order booking or pre order payment as partial or full payments and whenever the pre order product will be in stock then the customer will be notified through a mail that your pre order product is in stock and if customer have paid partial payment then the pre order notification will notify that you can complete your payment for your pre order product and if the customer have paid full payment for pre order then notification will be sent to the customer that your pre order product is in stock and it will delivered to you soon so to manage all these things we have to log in to our admin panel so this is our admin panel after installation we have to go to the extensions and modules so here in modules uh, you have to find the pre order module so here is pre order pro module you ha admin have to configure the pre order module as per the requirements so here is a pre order text here we have written pre order you can change it according to your needs or now here is pre order text so you must be thinking uh, these are two uh, same fields but uh, this is the text which is uh, for global where it will be shown uh, in category page product page and everywhere at the button pre order button and this text will be uh, shown at your product page so you can write any text as per you need so now here is pre order button here you can uh, change the pre order button work so redirect to contact add to pre order cart or add to cart you can select you have to select one among the three for pre order button work now on the notification mode is automatic manual or both for the pre order notifications and uh, the notification status uh, when it will be notified like in stock or out of stock or pre order or 2 3 days so notification will be sent now pre order mail you can disable or enable the pre order mail from here now pre order status is enable or disable you can set the pre order status from here now after general tab uh, we will go to add product tab now so here admin can select products for pre order admin can select multiple products from here and then admin have to select the payment options uh, the payment will be uh, full payment for pre order or percentage payment for pre order if you select percentage then uh, another uh, field will be displayed in front of you add price so you can 
extend the percentage uh, from here or if you select the full payment then this uh, field will be uh, vanished now here you can set date of pre-order product when the product will be available products will be available to the customer or product will be available in stock for the customers so you can uh, select date for all the pre-order products and you can apply it uh, by this button so here you can see uh, the product ID and success message so that's all uh, for this configuration you can see the success message now we will go to uh, the pre-order menu so here is pre-orders pre-order product list are displayed here you can uh, see the product name customer name customer email paid amount notification status and the status of payment full paid pre-ordered pre-ordered full paid like this so and you can notify uh, the customer by selecting them and by click on the notify button then the customers will be notified And you can also view the order history. So here is order ID, contact number, and all the details of uh, order, payment details, shipping details, products, and history. So here, you, admin can easily uh, see the order histories. Now, we will move to pre-order inquiry. In pre-order inquiries, admin can see the pro, uh, order inquiries for the pre-order. So these are the customers who have inquired about the pre-order products. So here admin can easily notify the customer. Here is product detail, here is query and here is email ID and customer name. So after the pre-order queries, uh, we will move to the pre-order product list. So here is the pre-order product list. These are the products which is uh, set as pre-order for uh, the website. So and you can uh, see the product name, model, pre-order price and direction type like percent and fixed. You can set it as uh, payment type as percentage and fixed. So admin can also delete products by selecting the product and click on delete will delete the pre-order product. So I will not delete the products. So uh, that's all from the admin part. Now we will go to uh, the front end. So uh, this is our front end. Here is the category pre-order. So in this pre-order category you can see the pre-order products uh, displayed so here are the pre-order products and here is the pre-order button so whenever you click on this button uh, the pre-order product will be ad added to your cart so we will open a product so here is uh, the pre-order product here is your message is displayed you can pre-order this product so here is a warning please log in to pre-order this product without login any customer cannot place 
an order so I will log in first so this is our demo customer account so now we will uh, again go to pre-order uh, category so I am on this product so I will try to add this product to my cart so I will have a cart so here is the success message you have added new pro to your shopping cart so in shopping cart uh, you can see one item is added now I will go and uh, try to add one more product to pre-order cart to show you what will happen adding pre-order to cart will remove all products are you sure pre uh, so this is a warning message that only one product can be added to the pre-order cart or you can say this in shopping cart if you are adding a pre-order product then only one product will be added if you try to add any other product then the earlier product will be removed from the cart so I will go to the cart and here you can see your shopping cart now I will go to the checkout in checkout you have to fill all the required information and customer can easily check out from your store so that's how the pre-order module works and whenever uh, the pre-order module uh, product will be uh, available for the customers uh, then the notification mail will uh, go to the customer that pre-order product is available now so that's all for this module i hope you have understood how to manage the pre-order uh, module from admin panel and how does it work in front end so thank you for watching this video stay connected